take a look at the back of Mike's leg as he runs. This is called the calf muscle. If this was injured, he would not be able to run. A common calf injury is a calf strain. The calf muscles consist of the gastronomies muscle, which is the big muscle at the back of the lower leg, and the solus muscle, which is a smaller muscle lower down in the leg. And under the gastronomies, this is very painful and would keep Mike sidelined from basketball for a while, so you'd have to rest up. Ways to prevent this from happening is stretching, being careful, and like always, getting fluids in your system. A key muscle used when jump roping are your hamstrings. If you do not stretch properly, you have a good chance of pulling your hamstring. They are located in the back of your leg above the knee. Just like the calf, this is very painful and will, will keep you sidelined. Ways to prevent this. Stretch more, stretch more than you think is enough and drink lots of fluids. People are doing curls. They are doing curls to get big biceps. This is what a bicep looks like. A common bicep injury is tearing it. This is extremely painful. It happens when you overwork yourself caused by muscle fatigue. Muscle fatigue is very underrated. People don't take it serious. They think they always have more left in them. But just, you, have, you just have to be smart. This also happens when the muscle yanks out of the shoulder socket. Ways to prevent this are to focus on your technique. Stretching and technique are really underrated and very important. This is what a bicep looks like. Push-ups are another big exercise. They are the strengths in Strengthen your triceps and pectoral muscles. Your triceps are located on the back of your arm. Your pectorals are located in your chest. Doing the push-ups the wrong way can lead to injuries. Doing push-ups the wrong way can severely injure the rotator cuff muscles, which are located in the shoulder. Avoiding rotator cuff pain may be as simple as a balancing muscle tension at the shoulder and improving your exercise technique. Technique is important in everything you do. You may not realize it, but it is so important. It can keep you healthy or keep you sidelined. It's obviously the most important muscle you have. Without it, you cannot live. Everything you do, you feel a heartbeat. The intenser the workout, the more you feel it. Let's see if Mike can feel it after his 500th squat. 47, 48, 49, 500. Ooh, I'm really feeling it. Everyone wants a six pack. Well, the way to do is is sit ups. Doing sit-ups helps your abdomen muscles, which creates a six-pack. Abdomen injuries can be very dangerous. It can create pain in your organs. So the way to be safe is go at your own speed and don't push yourself too far. Quadriceps is very underrated. Some people don't even know what they are. People don't realize how important they are and how painful they can be if you injure it. If you do not stretch properly, you can pull this muscle and just like your calf, be out for a while. Quadriceps are just as important as hamstrings and calves, if not more important. They are also called quads, as you might know. Take a look at Mike as he's in for a brutal awakening because he did not stretch while catching this pass. Ah! <laughs> what do I need to do to avoid injury? Well, right now, you should sit down and rest because you will be out for a good week or so. If you try to come back too fast, you can be out even longer. And if rest doesn't work, then there's always surgery, as the professionals have. You pulled your quad because you did not stretch. You also don't think stretching is important, but it is. That's the problem. Stretching is the most important thing before a workout or sporting event, just like being hydrated. It's very important. You cannot take this lightly, or else you will be in for a brutal awakening. I don't know how to stay healthy. Even though there are other ways to get injured, I will not get injured. In there are over 640 different muscles in your body. So be safe. There are a lot of injuries you can get. Skeletal muscle is what we can see and feel. When the bodybuilder is working out, skeletal muscle is what they're actually doing. Smooth muscle is found in your digestive system, blood vessels, bladder, and airways, and in the female, the uterus. Smooth muscle has the ability to stretch, and maintain tension for long periods of time. As you can see, Mike is stretching to maintain the tension, and he can do this for a long period of time if he wanted to. Cardiac muscle is found only in your heart, and its big features are endurance and consistency. It can stretch in a, it can stretch in a limited way, like smooth muscle, and can contract with force of skeletal muscle. Like Mike is contracting his bicep muscle right now. Mm.